Hey guys, in this video, I will be sharing with you how to unlock your brain's true potential by sharing with you some of the lessons, tricks and tips shared by John Esraf. For those of you who do not know him already, John Esraf is an entrepreneur, a philanthropist, a business growth expert, a teacher and an international speaker. He is also one of the leading behavioral and mindset experts in the world. John is well known to have helped thousands of people get rid of all the mental and emotional obstacles in their lives. So in this video, we will look into the two lessons that John Esraf speaks about in almost all his interviews and motivational videos. And these are firstly, how to train your brain to make more money. And second one is knowing the difference between interest and committed lesson one how to train your brain to make more money step one get clear on the exact amount of money that you want to earn per month for example we can say ten thousand dollars then second step is create a simple affirmation as follows i am so happy and grateful for the fact that i am now earning ten thousand dollars a month and you can replace the ten thousand dollars a month with the amount of money that you want to earn it can be five thousand a month or it can also be twenty thousand a month so it depends on you step three Read this affirmation every morning, 5 to 10 times, and every night before going to bed, 5 to 10 times. And as you read these affirmations, mentally rehearse that you are receiving this amount of money, and actually feel and pay attention to that feeling, onto how it feels like to consistently have this specific amount of money in your bank account and the impact of that money on your family, on your community and on yourself. And then there's a bonus step on how you can actually create this goal of earning this certain amount of money a reality even faster by visualization. So this bonus step or the final step is take a vision board and cut out some pictures earning 10,000 a month will allow you to live. For example, what car you will drive, what charitable organization you will support, what type of clothes you will wear, what type of house you will live in. and see yourself in that scenario and act as if it is real right now after this think what you can do today to make that amount of money a reality and write one or two action steps towards making this dream of yours a reality this will help you achieve all the financial goals that you have in your life and then moving on to the second lesson lesson two knowing the difference between interested and committed so if someone asks you if you are committed to achieving your goals or interested to achieving your goals what will you say well, some of us will respond, uh, um, what's the difference between the two? And John Esra tells us the exact differentiation between the two terms. And this was actually taught to him by his teacher, Mr. Brown. And it goes something like this. If you are interested in achieving your life goals, you will do what is convenient. You will be a victim to all your excuses why you cannot achieve your goals. And 
However, if you are committed to achieving your goals, you will do whatever it takes and you will let go of all excuses. You will upgrade your skills, you will upgrade your knowledge, and you will figure out every single day how you will achieve your goals and why you must achieve your goals. So be committed. Let go of all your excuses as to why you cannot achieve your goals. All it takes is commitment. Steps to be committed. Step one, take a sheet of paper and write one goal for every area of your life. For example, health, wealth, relationships, career, business, and charitable. Step two, write down beside each goal by when you want to achieve that particular goal. Step three, Write down three action steps that you can take towards achieving those goals. And the action steps are something as follows. First action step, what do I need to learn? Second action step, what do I need to believe in? And third action step, what do I need to do? Step four, write these down and Put it on your calendar by when you are going to achieve these things. Do this for each one of your goals and focus deeply on how you are planning to achieve these particular goals. So be the type of person who is committed to achieving their goals and dreams and not the person who only prays and wishes for their dreams to happen without putting in any effort at all. So the choice is yours. Are you committed to achieving your goals or interested in achieving your goals? So guys, with this thought, I'm ending this video. If you like the content, please like, subscribe and share it with friends and family. And if you want to learn more about John Asraf, join his YouTube channel. All the links are in the description below. And I hope this video has helped motivate you guys to set and achieve all your goals in life. Till the next video, take care and stay blessed.